Hello everyone, welcome to another video. In this video, we have a couple of news on new YouTube data stories. So in this video, I will show you how to use data stories in YouTube analytics or YouTube data stories. So as you can see, YouTube shares more info on its coming data stories analytics element. So this will be an element in analytics where you will be able to see data stories. So let me tell you how this will look like. As you can see, YouTube has provided some info on its data stories analytic test, which provides insights into your channel performance in a simple stories like format, and it's accessible to some users at present via YouTube Studio. Now, this is still not an official feature. Of course it is, but it is not still available for everyone. So keep that in mind. YouTube first previewed its data stories element in August with selected users being shown a prompt to access the option from the main overview. As you can see here, you can click here on uh, this learn how YouTube recommends content and then here you will be able to see uh, data stories, right? Recommendations are based on a few different things and then you can take a closer look, right? Do your videos keep people watching? So this basically means that this will be like a helper tab in your YouTube analytics where you will be able to see more data about your videos to make your videos much, much better. As you can see uh, here, by tapping on the see how YouTube recommends content, which is this right here, uh, users are then able to access the data stories element, which provides simplified overviews of key channel performance aspects in swipeable full screen display. Right, so you will be able to see, you know, audience, content, monetization, and education about YouTube, right? Now, as you can see, this is, uh, again, another example of how, um, you know, YouTube will use data stories in your YouTube analytics as well. Really, really awesome, really clean, it looks awesome, it's simple, um, and as you can see, uh, here, for example, on this one, you already made viewers return with these. Now this means that these thumbnails are probably the winning thumbnails, right? So you can use more of those thumbnails, right? And you also hear, here's how to keep them coming back, right? So how to keep your audience coming back to your videos. Really awesome tips by YouTube. So this is kind of like a section where YouTube will give you free tips on how to grow on YouTube, which is awesome, right? Now other aspects that can be displayed here are recommendations on how to make better thumbnails as I said previously, and further notes on how to improve the chances of your content being recommended, as you can see right here. It's pretty, pretty awesome. So this is basically what YouTube is going to roll out really, really soon. Uh, it's a really great, um, I would say, addition or feature to the YouTube uh, studio. And yeah, comment down below what you think about this feature. And yeah, we'll see you in the next video. Thank you guys for watching.